Hello and welcome back to World of Tanks with Professor R. Happy April Fool's Day. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Carl, which is the Tier 1 German SPG. Now, this tank is its just amazing. It has 1500 hit points, which rivals that of Tier 8s. It's even better than some Tier 8s. It, it only weighs 20.92 tons when it doesn't have anything equipped. But it also has a 1200 horsepower engine, which means it can easily get to its speed limit of 70 kilometers an hour. And also with that big of an engine, you got a great traverse speed of 60 degrees per second. Now, we also have a 400 meter view range, which is better than tier 9s, even some tier 10s. And the tier 1 radio is a whopping 750 meters. So already this tank is looking good. Let's just take a look at its gun. Look at that. It's the biggest gun in the game. And take that. And put it with 30 rounds per minute. Which is also, which is about 2 second reload. 50 penetration and 300 average damage. You've got a huge damage per minute number. But, 0.7 accuracy, that doesn't look too good. But it doesn't matter, because it has a 2 second aiming time. So this gun is just amazing. The only drawback with it though, you have all this amazing stuff. But you only have 10 millimeters of armor, all around. So it's not going to be hard to penetrate you. You can do tons of damage in return. So let's just at a small tank. Let's take a look at this. M36 Jackson. Okay. Pretty small tank. Let's take a look at the TOG. TOG is known for being a big tank. TOG is a big tank. Let's even look at the Yag Tiger. Okay. Now look at Carl. It is huge. And it is so much better than every other tank. Like, did you... Those... That gun is just amazing. 2 second reload, 300 damage, it's awesome. So let's go take a look at a replay in the Carl. So here we are. As you notice, we are on the World of Tanks 8-bit Tales map, which has just perfected everything in this game. The players asked, they received. It's a perfect, balanced map. It is symmetrical all the way around. And also, only Carls can play on this, so the matchmaking is flawless. And they also updated World of Tanks with new sounds, and you can't beat that, can you? The graphics are just stunning. Oh, there's a Carl. Look at that aim time. Look at that reload! This is just amazing! And just like that, 900 damage done. Oh, there's another Carl! Look at that reload! Blowing out shells left and right. The one drawback though, it doesn't have that it, uh, range isn't that good on the Carl. But who needs range? Get stuck here on block, but no worries. Just go on through. Oh, two more Carls. This demonstrates the Carl's rapid firing gun. And it's hitting every single shot. Even on the move. Almost fell there, but we're still safe. We're getting hit. And there they are. Like, those Carl's can't outmatch me. I don't have that much health left. We gotta get out of here.
that is just beautiful water over there. It's just the best graphics I've ever seen, really. And here's where the range issue comes in again. You don't have enough range. That aim time is nice, though. Unfortunately, hit a block there, but. There's only two Carls left. You have a nice thing about the Carl. You can hold a thousand rounds of ammo for those really, really long battles. There's the last Carl. So you, there's no worry of running out of ammo anytime soon. Let's go take a look at the results. Alright, so here we are. And of course, no credits, no experience, but who cares. We got 5,000 credits though for being in the top 5. And we also got a nice little badge for playing in Carl. Let's take a look at the team score. Right there. We did the most damage on our team at least. 2,775 with 2 kills. Only one person on the enemy team did better than I did. So let's go on to our detailed report. 20 shots fired, 13 of those hit and did damage. I received 3 hits, but that was enough to kill me. Got 1200 spotting damage. And again, 5000 credits for that bonus mission. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more. And we'll see you guys later.